Final preparations for an age-old ceremony. These dancers are ethnic Yoruba, a West African people mostly based in Nigeria. Here in Benin, they make up just 10% of the population, but their traditions hold special value, in particular the Galedi, a song and dance ceremony performed every year after the harvest. Women, who play the main role, decorate themselves in white clay. The whiteness is the sign that we are immaculate, that we're pure. It's also the sign of divinity. And then the dancing and singing begins. But this is more than just a performance. The Glede also has a social purpose. It's a tool for regulating morals, for controlling social tension. It's also a tool for recreating life. The ceremony was first held more than a century ago to honor the spirits of female ancestors. Today it's a celebration of the harvest and fertility, but still reflects the important role of women in Yoruba life. Being in the middle of this gives me a certain ease, a kind of social presence, firstly as a woman, but also as someone who's grown up in this culture. Without the Galede, there would be a gap in my life. It's the core of my existence. In 2001, the ceremony received the ultimate endorsement when it was named by UNESCO as a masterpiece of oral cultural heritage. The organization since led a campaign to preserve the tradition in communities in Benin, as well as Nigeria and Togo, so the torch can be passed to future generations.